Again, the James Webb Space Telescope has recently captured groundbreaking observations of two supermassive black holes. In this video, we will explore the discovery of two supermassive black holes merging over 13 billion light years away, delve into the significance of galaxy mergers, and unravel new theories about black hole formation without the collapse of stars. So without further ado, let's get started. Deep in the fabric of space-time, over 13 billion light years from Earth, Webb has captured an event so monumental that it challenges our foundational understandings of cosmic evolution. We're talking about two supermassive black holes, each with a mass about 50 million times that of our Sun, caught in a gravitational dance that predates almost every major event in the known universe. This discovery is not merely about observing a rare event, it's about witnessing a merger in an epoch known as the Cosmic Dawn, just 740 million years after the Big Bang. This timing is crucial. It's a period when the universe was barely out of its infancy, yet these black holes had already grown to sizes that defy our standard models of astrophysical growth. How did these titans of the cosmos get so massive so quickly? First, it provides a direct challenge to the existing theories of black hole formation and growth. According to previous understanding, black holes of such magnitude should take much longer to form and develop, primarily through the accumulation of mass from collapsed stars and the gradual accretion of matter. However, the sheer size and the early appearance of these merging black holes suggest a more rapid and perhaps different mechanism of growth. Moreover, this also offers us a glimpse into the conditions of the early universe. The light from this event has traveled over 13 billion years to reach us, carrying with it information from a time when the universe was less than 6% of its current age. The near-infrared camera, the mid-infrared instrument, and the near-infrared spectrograph of Webb made this discovery possible. Each instrument plays a role in detecting and analyzing the faint signals emanating from these distant cosmic phenomena. So, the question is, could it be that these massive entities were not just products of the evolving universe, but also architects of the cosmic landscape? Now, let's delve deeper into the context of the environment of the merging event. These behemoths do not exist in isolation. They are the centers of their respective galaxies. In this case, Webb has provided evidence that the black holes are part of an even larger cosmic event an ongoing merger of two galaxies. Galaxy mergers are among the most spectacular and fundamental processes in the universe, involving much more than simple collisions. These complex, dynamic interactions fundamentally reshape the structure and future evolution of the galaxies involved. As galaxies merge, their stars, gas, and dust are driven by gravitational forces into a complex dance, leading to new star formation and altering their structure. This activity can funnel vast amounts of material into central supermassive black holes, fueling their growth at accelerated rates. This observation is critical because it highlights a direct pathway through which supermassive black holes can attain such enormous sizes, particularly in the early universe. As the galaxies intertwine, their black holes come closer, eventually leading to the merger observed. The process of merging not only influences the growth of black holes, but also the evolution of galaxies themselves. It reshapes their structures, redistributes their gas, and ignites new star formation, leading to the rejuvenation of galaxies in a new form. Such phenomena were theorized, but observing them in action, particularly at such a significant cosmological distance, offers invaluable insights. It supports the idea that the early universe underwent rapid changes, with galaxy mergers playing a crucial role in the formation of large-scale structures observed in the cosmos today. Furthermore, this can tell us about the mystery of how black holes influence their surroundings. The energy and matter interactions around these supermassive black holes during a merger can have profound effects on the galactic ecosystem. They can regulate the rate of star formation and dictate the chemical composition of future generations of stars and planetary systems. Traditionally, it was believed that black holes formed primarily from the remnants of massive stars. However, the observation of a supermassive black hole 
formed just 470 million years after the Big Bang, introduces a radical alternative, the direct collapse of massive gas clouds. The theory that these early universe black holes could form directly from collapsing gas clouds has now moved from theoretical speculation to observed reality. If black holes can form directly from gas clouds without the intermediary step of star formation, it would mean that the early universe had conditions conducive to the rapid and massive accumulation of matter in dense regions. This process leads to the creation of superheated X-ray emitting gas around the newly formed black hole, which James Webb and Chandra have now observed. This method of formation could explain how supermassive black holes appeared so quickly after the Big Bang. It also provides a mechanism for their rapid growth as these early black holes would have had access to copious amounts of gas in the young universe, allowing them to grow at unprecedented rates, which challenges the traditional view of black hole growth, which posited that black holes grew primarily by accreting matter from their surroundings slowly over time. Additionally, confirming X-ray emissions from this process gives astronomers a new method to identify similar early universe black holes by their X-ray signatures providing insights into the prevalence of this type of black hole formation. In conclusion, these insights from Webb reshape our understanding of the cosmos, revealing that the early universe was a place of rapid growth and dynamic changes, far more active and complex than previously imagined. As we continue to explore these ancient lights, we keep unraveling the mysteries of the cosmos each discovery adding depth to our understanding of the universe's grand narrative. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the cosmos as we explored groundbreaking discoveries made by the James Webb Space Telescope. Keep looking up and questioning, as every star and every galaxy has a story to tell.